Here's an example of how to find the tension. A 25 kilogram lamp is hanging from a rope. What is the tension force being supplied by the rope? We have a little bit of information here. One, we're given that the mass is equal to 25 kilograms. It's hanging from a rope. That means it's not moving and it's certainly not accelerating. So we have that the acceleration is zero. And now we're being asked to find the tension force on the rope. Let's start off by drawing a little picture. Here's a crude picture of a lamp. And we have two forces acting on it. One is the weight of the lamp pulling down. The other is the force of tension in the rope pulling it up. So let's draw this as a free body diagram. Simple dot for the lamp, arrow pointing downward for the weight, and pointing upward an equal amount of vector to show us the force of tension. And again, we'll just mark that our acceleration is zero. To solve this, we'll start with Newton's second law. The net force is equal to mass times acceleration. But we know that the acceleration is zero, so we'll set that. Now what about the net force? Well, there are two forces acting here, an upward tension force and a downward weight. So we'll just write these down. Tension up, weight down, and it's equal to zero. So adding mg to both sides, we get force of tension is equal to mg. Now, to find the values, we'll just plug in the numbers. m is 25 kilograms, and g, as we know, is 9.8 meters per second squared, and the result is 245 newtons.